Hey guys, welcome to another video, and today it is a Christmas haul video! I am... Um, what the hell is that? I'm dying. Uh, yeah, I'm a little bit behind. Sorry. It's been a busy couple of weeks, so I apologise that I've not made a video, but, you know, just keep on rolling out these haul videos. That seems to be when I return. It's just like, haul video in your face, and I'm gone again. But anyway, Christmas haul. This year was a good one. Yes, it was. Yes! Yes! So, I uh, managed to pick up, let's go straight into it, I'm not even going to mess around here, you know, I'm just going to get straight into it. I'm going to go, ah, I thought it kind of failed a little bit, uh, but look, yeah, it's a Micro Machine playset, it is the, uh, the finalizer is what it's called, yes, uh, the Super First Order Star Destroyer set. Normally retails for $44.99, I think it is, $39.99, $44.99. Managed to find this in Asda or your Walmart in America for uh, $19.99 and it came with 12 additional vehicles and figures. So that's pretty crazy. So I'm glad I managed to find that. Whilst we're on the micro machines, look at all that. Look at all that in there. Wow. That's a lot of stuff in there now. I'm pretty sure I only started this, what, two months ago? Oops. Addicted. Addicted much. I know JCC's made a video of this uh, and I've not yet got around to watching it because I'm a crappy subscriber but I will get around to watching everyone's videos I promise it's just been so busy so so busy next is a couple of Power Rangers I managed to find Fury I didn't think I'd ever find him he seemed to become very rare in the UK a bit weird normally nobody buys Power Ranger figures except for me uh, I always forget this guy is it a Vivix pretty sure it's a Vivix thug we'll call him a thug uh, we also got Gold Ranger I need to find Graphite, I know he's out there, and I will find him, I will kill him. No, uh, no, we're just going to find him, I'm not going to kill him. But there you go. That's nice, it's nice, isn't it? Good, good. Is there anything else on the floor? No. Now, uh, Secret Santa appears a thing. I'm not sure. Secret Santa is a thing here in the UK. I don't know if you guys have it over in America, but here I got this. Yeah, it is a Star Wars book. No, it's the Visual Dictionary. The barcode on the front and the back. What the hell is going on? Hello! Well, oh, okay, I kind of came in on visual effects. Nice! So there you go, that was pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. This was a little something I bought my... This was a little something I bought myself just because it had a couple of things. So there's a little turbo laser. Pew, pew. It doesn't spin overly well. It also comes with, and I've not got the weapons for these guys because I've left them in the lounge because I'm an idiot. Uh, just a couple of Imperial officers. This guy's pretty neat, except for it looks like he looks so daft. I don't know how well you can see that, but he looks really stupid. I also got, oh no, he should go this side, you know? No, he's fine now. This little Imperial officer, that's pretty cool, pretty cool. And then, just the reason why I bought it, because I'm a sucker for these designs, some Stormtroopers. Well, this is a Heavy Trooper. I didn't realise that when I bought it, but there's a Stormtrooper, a Heavy Trooper. So if you buy this set, it's like 10 dollars you can keep stucking up on these guys and get a, quite a formidable army. And a few men, because they've all got like heads underneath, so you can change them around on that, so you can get a bit of a unique look. But yeah, pretty awesome. I really like those. Very happy with that indeed. I don't think I forgot anything during this Christmas haul, by the way. It was, like I said, it's been such a manic time that I can't remember if I got everything, but I'm pretty sure I did. Maybe. My brother did pretty spectacular in getting me uh, this Disney metal diecast X-Wing type thing. This is the exact terms. Google it, you'll find it. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. I definitely recommend if you are near a Disney store or even hesitant on these, don't be. They're so cool. And they're like $7.99 here in the UK, so... Get yourselves down and get your get one. It's amazing. Excuse me, you're in the way. Can you stand like that? Of course you can. I don't recall if I ever showed this lady in a video. I don't think I did, but I managed to pick up Captain Phasma. If I did show her in a previous video, I do apologise. It's been it feels like it's been a long time since I've been on YouTube, but according to my YouTube it's only been a week. Alright then. Uh but yeah. Ta -da! How cool is that? Uh, I finally got her. So glad, so glad. I'm pretty sure I've shown her off before. Carrying on with the Black Series figures now. I've also managed to get Constable Zuvio. What are you doing? No. No. Yeah, Constable Zuvio. Pretty cool. Nice, nice, nice. And also... Oh, God. Oh, oh God. Okay. I also got the Guavin and Volsa. Uh-huh. 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 U
this one. I tried to heat it up and cool it down, but because the plastic is just gummy naturally, it doesn't really solidify anything. It just goes from really gummy to gummy again. Mm. Now, the main gift, and I think that is all of the, like, well, I mean, I got loads of socks and, you know, food and deodorant like you would normally, but I, I'm pretty sure I covered everything. That was meant to. I'm pretty sure I did. If I didn't, I apologise. But, uh, yeah, the main thing I got this year, and I was so happy to get this, just simply for one game. One game alone! And it was... The PlayStation 4. <laughs> oh, can you guess what's coming next? Oh, yes, you're right. I did get the Battlefront. It's the best day of my life. Uh, I've literally been playing this solidly for ages, so that's probably why I've not made any videos. It sounds empty. Oh, of course, because I was playing it all night. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so a few of you guys have got in contact with me because I put this on the Facebook page. Uh, we've had a few games together, so that's really good fun. Uh, do hit me up if you want to watch me die a lot because I'll happily add you and we can I've got a headset so we can talk or geeky things as I die but uh yeah so cool so cool and I got the Vita as well so I can just go upstairs into my bed and play Battlefront while in bed it's pretty difficult but you know it can be done moving on uh normally I take a little break in January normally it's the whole of January I come back in February I think because it doesn't because I've shortened just to one video a week it doesn't really feel like I'm pressured that much, I don't know, just under that much pressure to try and get the videos out and it doesn't really feel like it's straining me so I might take a week or so just to, because I want to do a couple of things to edit the channel um, and yeah and I don't know if you noticed right now but the lighting in here is a lot better because I just whacked out a fair bit of cash today to get two new lights so now everything's all nice and crisp, ready for the reviews because there will be a lot more of those and now that I've got a gaming thing I'm going to become a gaming channel I'm just joking. You imagine if I did? Wow. So many people now are like, Oh, I'm a toy reviewer and I'll be a gaming channel too. Uh, you just join the crew. There's like millions of them. <laughs> you could fire an arrow in any direction and hit a gaming reviewer. But, uh, yeah, so cool. Two new lights. Great spiffing. Ready for 2016. But anyway, guys, that is everything. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, I will see you all later!